Hello everyone, it's Stacy Nicole here with SNS Scraps and this is a scrapbook process video for my family album and the photos I'm scrapping today are of my nephew Chance when he was really little. <laughs> He's all grown up and a Marine now. It's crazy how time flies. It makes me feel so old. <laughs> but anyway, I'm moving on to the scrapbook video. Um, for the most part, I use the Photoplay collection um, Rap City, the Rap City collection by Photoplay really pretty collection. The colors I used were this tailish blue, a red, and the navy. And you'll see this navy piece of paper kind of brings all those um, colors together. Here I'm looking at my photos and I've decided to put um, the little, the smaller photos in chipboard frames. That way they kind of stand out more from the main photo. Because that main photo pretty much takes up the whole scrapbook page. And I'm not sure if I mentioned it, these uh, chipboard frames are from Simple Stories. Here I'm just backing um, that main photo on that red piece of paper that I talked about. It's kind of, it's not a red red, it's it's not really orange red either. I'm not sure really what, maybe a rose red would be a good description of this paper. The, I apologize the colors aren't showing up as they are on here. Um, but there is that really pretty pattern in navy blue paper that brings up in all those um, colors. And I just, I did a 4 by a 12 um, strip there and backed my photos on that. So I put my main photo down and then I decided to cluster the other photos around it that are in the chipboard frames. This is going to be the main layout for Chance's part of his album. So I really wanted to make sure it, it kind of showed his, um, his personality. <laughs> and he's got multiple parts of his personality. If you see this one photo, he's just giving me a sneer. He hated taking photos. Um, when he got a little older, he started pointing at the camera all the time. So most of the photos I have of him, he's pointing at a camera. <laughs> So I um, started out with this sticker from the Rap City Collection. It's a really pretty camera sticker. And then I grabbed a few things from my stash, um, the arrow and the love, and um, a flat um, sticker brad there. And I just created a cluster. And then I can't have a cluster without enamel dots. So those enamel dots were from Bella Boulevard. I started this other cluster with another sticker from the Rap City Collection. And I went and dived into my sticker stash and got a Chamel Puffy sticker out and a corkboard sticker and I started my other cluster and it looked okay but I felt like it still needed something so my bright idea was uh, to put this other sticker it, it kind of reminds me of a doily I'm not quite sure what you would call those stickers they're really cute um, so I had the bright idea of taking up this cork part and it fell apart those cork cards are so old for my stash so it doesn't surprise me that it fell apart so I found another just um, die cut heart that was brown and I put that in its place. And then I went back to the sticker sheet and I grabbed these two feathers and put it behind um, the one photo and started my last cluster. I just want you to know I forgot to put the title, I, I forgot to film the title um, for this. And the title was just simple, it's Chance, so check that out at the end of the video and you'll see. But for the most part, this process video is done. Thank you all for watching. Thank you to for all the new subscribers, totally shocked. I've been sick and it's just been a delight to see all these new subscribers all sudden. So thank you for all for watching and happy scrapbooking.